New information coming into us tonight in connection with yesterday's double murder in the King's Crossing subdivision. Court documents now confirm the victims and the 72 year old suspect were all related and police today released some gruesome details of what officers say they saw when they first arrived on the scene. Our Michelle Pedraza joins us now with the latest invest on this investigation. Michelle? And Joe, very chilling details were revealed in those court documents saying the grandfather of the Zaman family has been named the suspect. He is 72-year-old Mohammed Sahi. He faces charges of capital murder and assault with a deadly weapon. In a probable cause statement, three news got a hold of CCPD responded to the family's home on Denain Drive near Oso Parkway. It states after committing the crime, Sahi approached his neighbor with blood spatter on his face. When officers arrived, they saw Sahi, who they say calmly confessed to them that he killed his family. Inside the home, police found the body of 47 year old Narjis Zaman, Sahi's daughter and her 18 year old son, Hamid Zaman. Both had severe head and facial trauma. Officers said Sahi used a stick as a weapon. A third victim, Narjis's other son, 21 year old Hamza Zaman, also injured, was sent to Bay Area hospital. No update on his condition. Now, Sahih's bond is currently set at $2.75 million. His case has been assigned to the 105th District Court. Of course, extremely tragic story for this family and those who knew him. And stay with 3 News for the latest information as the story continues to develop. Joe. Yeah, just awful in that neighborhood.